guys, we are going to be reviewing the new titanium Type R exhaust for the Subaru VBWRX 2022 Plus from Tomei. And I'm super excited to have this exhaust. The quality is absolutely unreal. I cannot believe how nice the muffler section looks. I'm super impressed with it. And you can see how, how thick it is. And it's crazy. Look how nice all these welds are on this titanium. And this is the biggest thing that I wanted with this. Since we already have a titanium exhaust on the VBWX, it is a little loud on, on the freeway at like 70 miles an hour. There's a little bit of a drone. And so the biggest thing I really wanted with this Tomei is this resonator pipe that's in the front mid pipe. And I think this is gonna really help keep the noise down when I'm on the highway. Look how nice that Extreme titanium logo is, looks nice. And I like how this is titanium and they've got the burnt look on it. I can't wait to get it on the car to see what type of colors it turns. And as far as weight, this thing just weighs just under 18 pounds. It was like 28 pounds in the box. And thank you to Import Image Racing. I ordered this from them and I received it in like two days. Super fast shipping. I'll put a link in the description down below for this exhaust system. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot lots of b-roll. I want to show you guys the quality. I'm gonna switch all my different lenses and show you everything that I see in person if you guys are considering one. So we have all the accessories on the table and I'll just let you guys take a quick look at them. So you got all your nice hardware, everything is zinc coated. You got different sized gaskets to connect everything. It's even pretty cool to put actual Tomei badge. If you wanted to put a Tomei badge on your car, it's awesome. You got different size stickers, small, large, license plate hanger. You got your smooth bolt paste. And then when you connect the different sections of the exhaust system, it comes with basically like a rubber insulator to put around the spring to keep the vibration. There's a QR code for the installation instruction. And I'm highly impressed here when you dive farther and in looking into things and you look at like the silencer, this thing is titanium as well. So made didn't skip out at all versus like you can see that this is highly magnetic. There's no magnetic pull on this. Even the exhaust muffler hanger, this has no magnetic it's all titanium, 100% titanium all the way around. Even the brackets themselves, these are titanium to connect the sections. There's literally no magnetic su suction to any of that except for just the hardware itself. Those bolts are stainless steel, but everything is titanium. So it's gonna be super strong, super lightweight, and it's not gonna corrode. It's gonna last a long time and it's gonna look good. Since this is the third exhaust system I've installed in the car, I'll overlay some video of me removing the stock exhaust. Got a few bolts that we're gonna remove and nuts holding it on. So we got a 14 mil on the back, 12 mil in the front. Press on the end of it. I'm going to use a little bit of uh, silicone spray just on the exhaust hangers up here and it'll just slip right out. So inside the box it comes with the bigger hardware or the smaller hardware. I opted to drill out the J-pipe with a step drill so I could fit the thicker hardware in for more structural strength. All right, we have the exhaust fully assembled. Since it's so light, it's easy just to put it all on in one piece. 
I left these exhaust clamps kind of loose so the springs will kind of hold them in place and then once I get it into position I can tighten all these bolts um, on the car and we'll be good to go here. But look how freaking sexy this looks. This resonator, I'm so excited to do the first startup. Look at all the welds. This freaking thing is a piece of art. And comparing it to like Mines, which is another huge company out of Japan. Look at the welds on the Mines titanium strut tower bar. And look at the welds on the Tomei USA full titanium exhaust. The welds here are actually better. A lot better than this. Um, these are probably done by hand. These are probably done by a machine, I would imagine. For this, hit the thumbs up on the video if you guys like this type of content. It really helps the channel and uh, helps me to keep producing content like this. I try to do my best as a creator to show you guys every little detail that you'd want to see, just like you were looking at the part in person at home in your own garage. But this is the biggest reason I spent all the extra money. I really want this resonator. For date night, having my wife in my car, cutting the sound down would be nice. Happy wife, happy life, as they say. Come on, do it. Get to the chopper. Just mocked up the fitment around this rear cross member section of the frame is so much better where it goes to the rear lower control arms there's tons of space around here you don't have to worry about any type of rubbing at all tons of space between this and the rear diff and fitment is fantastic yeah what do you think uh what looks different back here when you're adjusting for fitment as you clock this uh this pipe right here kind of rotates the muffler in the position. So we're going to keep it right there. It looks good. excited with the way that it looks. I love the blue with the World Rally blue paint on my car and I like how it sticks out just a little bit farther than the bumper and there's plenty of room around so you're not going to have any issue with melting the plastic. All right let's get that cold start. There's definitely a lot less exhaust sound and while with, with having that much more of a quiet exhaust you can hear more of the turbo whistle which is cool. Definitely a gentleman's exhaust. The idle is very close to what the stock exhaust was. Super quiet. Alright, these revs are from about 20 feet away, guys. Give me a hundred likes on this video and I'll test the silencer for you. There's a tiny in, inside silencer which is uh, stage two and then there's you could take this inner ring out and that would be silencer stage one. If you guys missed the STI brake kit install that we did, performance mods and a Protune, full VB build, everything is pretty much done. <laughs>
this is definitely the gentleman's exhaust. It's so much wider. It's third, fourth, fifth. We're going uh, 2,000 RPMs, 42 miles an hour. Open the windows. Put the window up. Definitely a gentleman's exhaust. My wife will be much happier on date nights because that was the one thing she didn't like about the previous exhaust systems is they were loud. This is quiet, but you can still hear it. We're gonna go ship my R32 stock mass airflow sensors that somebody bought off my eBay store. Right across the post office has an R33 GTR and a Koki or Kuki S14. While I'm out, I'm just grabbing a few tools and picking up some parts from the Subaru dealership. Stick to the end of the video, guys. I will have a full outside driving review. All right, guys, so now we're going 72 miles an hour down the freeway. And it's very nice and quiet in here. This is gonna make the car a lot better for road trips. If you're somebody that doesn't want the exhaust to be too loud when you're just cruising, I think this is the right ticket. Third time's a charm after having the ETS. It was really loud on the freeway. The Noble was quieter, but it was still kind of loud at 70. And this is not that loud. So it's, it's not annoying to me where I found the other ones kind of annoying when you're cruising for a long period of time. Make sure you guys stick to the end of the video. I will have a bunch of outside cinematic driving shots to fully capture how awesome this Tomei titanium exhaust sounds on the car. To make good use of my time while I'm waiting for my camera girl to be available, who's my daughter Madison, I love to eat and I figured I'd take you guys along, grab some lunch, and then we'll get on with the review. If you guys ever make it up to Bonnie Lake, you gotta go to Sumalese Thai. Their Thai food is the absolute best that I've had anywhere in the area that I live. Check it out. this system a huge thumbs up thank you to import image racing for getting this shipped out to me um, like i said if you guys like the exhaust i will have it linked in the description down below for the exact one i ordered they make it in both single and dual tip whatever you guys prefer well, guys that's going to wrap up today's video i hope you enjoyed the installation and the sound clips of the tomei titanium type r exhaust for the vbwx Thank you to Import Image Racing for the fast shipping again. And uh, yeah, super happy with it. You guys let me know in the comments down below what you think. Um, if you guys get me 100 likes on this video, I will do a full silencer test and comparison versus the other exhaust systems I have. So hit the thumbs up, guys. I will see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.